DIY with Chris, giving you the tools to do it yourself. Okay, so I'm going to be doing a real quick review on this Black & Decker hammer drill. I had bought this from Lowe's for about $50 after discount. Um, it's a 6 amp, 1 half inch drill, and it has both regular and hammer settings. How you change it is up here at the top, and it switches very easily. It is the regular drill side, and it does have a picture of that drill. And you just switch it right over. The other side is the hammer side, as you can see that picture right there. And so that's going to be your hammer setting. You cannot switch between these during operation, uh, so just make sure that you do stop on that. It is a safety feature that is on it. The front handle mounts. It connects and disconnects. If you turn it left, then it loosens it, and that is how you're able to pull it off. But if you turn it right and twist it all the way, then that tightens the handle down. I use this mainly for drilling into concrete when I have to, uh, particularly when I was mounting my flag bracket. And this front handle here was actually very nice during that process. It gave me that extra leverage and it was able to help me get that extra force behind the drill there. Um, so I like that very much. There also is another attachment that comes through the top here and that is the ruler as you'll see on the link below at the site for this product that has a ruler and so you can measure the depth at which you're drilling on there so that is actually very nice on it the power it is corded uh, so the power is is pretty good I actually prefer corded drills over cordless for this power factor um, because they generally last longer, obviously, due to the fact that they don't have to change the batteries. But it seems like they, a lot of the time, have more power, more ampage on there. So I, I like them quite a bit better if I can actually use them. The cord seems to be about five feet long. Uh, some of the bits, while I've been using this, have came loose during operation. And it doesn't happen real frequently, but I have noticed it, particularly with the hammer drill setting. Um, when I was trying to drill into some of the concrete on multiple occasions. So those are just a few things about it. It is a very wonderful drill. I love it very much. And I it's I actually use this because I do have another Black & Decker just corded drill. And I use this one over that every time because it has both the corded and the hammer drill settings on there. So I can go back and forth between depending on what the situation calls for. Because if it's having a hard time getting through something, then I can switch it over to the hammer drill setting and we can just power right through it. Uh, so it's a really nice drill and I would recommend this highly. I enjoy it very much. I hope you found this video useful. Thank you.